All right, 64 North Brookside here in Springfield. Actually came in the back door. The neighbor has a pool and there was a nice doggy there. But here is the quick little scan. Uh, directly, actually this way is a nice little part of Springfield. Um, some shops within walking distance. But here we are coming in the front door. I'm gonna lock this because they wanted it locked. Try to follow the rules. So nice screen door there. I believe it's a Pella. Um, and here we are. So let's keep this how they want it. They definitely want people coming in the back door. And uh, I'm assuming there's hardwoods under these rugs here. And the ceiling too. Looks like acoustic tiles. So if we have a corner here, we can explore because based on the year this house was built, there's got to be hardwoods under here. And I should have pliers with me. Ah, we got lucky. All right, so this is what you want to see. Actually, pretty nice hardwoods. There you are. Let's put this back properly. There we go. Yeah. So that's cool. Uh, you have a chair rail in place and thin crown molding. I actually have your window, window sills too. And while I'm here, why not? Newer updated windows, vinyl, double clasp. And here we are. So kitchen, clearly there's gonna be some renovations going on for somebody who wants this, but neat and clean. So that's good gas cooking. This is where I came in, just to show you. So came in here. Show the backyard a little bit for you. So got a little bit of a hill and then a flat area up there. Nice shed, uh, mini awning here. And uh, that roof looks like, yeah, it's three tab. So check that on the disclosure. Three tab's a little bit of an older style. Now they use 3D architectural shingles that overlap. But nonetheless, gotta check that. So this was added on. This is probably a porch because you have the brick wall. And I'll spin around, hopefully slowly, show you that. And this is just a closet. We got a pull chain. Okay. Just a closet and a half bath. So here you go. Again, neat and clean. There's actually wallpaper in here. Um, I would suggest or recommend, you know, some updating. All right, that completes the first level. Let's shoot upstairs. Cool. Again, continues. Nice, neat, and clean. But this is all original, I imagine, except from the toilet and uh, the sink. Attic access. Here we have a bedroom. They have things marked as sold, too. Wallpaper in there. Little linen closet. It's just like my friend's Dan, uh, Dan's house. So you can see the hardwoods up here. Same as downstairs. Competing closets there. And did they continue with new windows up here? They did. All the windows appear to be updated. And this is the smaller room. So there you are. And that is just a closet. So there you go. Uh, neat and clean. <laughs> Again, I will reiterate that, but let's check out the basement. And uh, yeah, you, you can do a lot of upgrades just getting these carpets up, in my opinion. That'll help tremendously. Basement, here we go. Lights, perfect. So, I hear a dehumidifier running. That's fantastic. It's this trim. Smells good down here. It's finished with a finished ceiling, plenty of headroom. Here we are in the utility section. Seeing if we can see a light. Dehumidifier is running right there. There's your heater. Laundry's down here, electric dryer. That's a Bradford White hot water heater, gas fed. Oh yeah, and you can see everything here. Yeah, I, I, would, I would say this is fairly clean. And there's your panel. Maybe we'll get lucky. Is this a real light? Check this out. <laughs> Crazy. All right. There you go. Uh, it looks like 200 amp. 
I'd verify that on the disclosure, of course. But there we are. So, good amount of space down here. And uh, smells nice. <laughs> Not much more you can ask for for a basement. But that completes our tour. So, if I think of anything else, I'll keep this running. But uh, I think that's it. So, good bones on a, a semi-main road. And uh, let's see if we get lucky here. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Got lucky on that one. Good. All right. Slow it down a little bit more. That's an awesome pool. See the side of the house? There's the AC unit. Looks like it was put in by Oliver. Reputable quality company. And there we are. So you have the stone front, the brick on the side. Very nice indeed. And then you see a little bit more of the neighborhood. Yeah, side street there. We got some kiddos riding bikes. There we are. It's a slow turn. And uh, I'll leave you right there.